Hey guys, welcome to a new vlog. Um, if you're new here, welcome. If you're not new here, welcome back. Um, my name is Pamela and I am a lifestyle and travel vlogger. Um, I hope, if you haven't seen my previous vlogs yet, go watch those. But I hope my audio is a bit better. I'm using a microphone now, like an actual microphone. Um, so I hope it's much better than it used to be. Because while editing, like I didn't really like the sound of my voice and the way it was sounding in my vlog. So just decided to get a microphone this time. So anyways, it's Monday, start of a new week, that's why we're starting a new vlog. So I am starting this off in the evening and I want to unbox something that I just got. I just got a juicer. I want to start uh, making juices. My friend sent me this recipe for uh, juices that's supposed to be good for black women for like hormone balancing and stuff like that. So it arrived over the weekend but I was gone. So this is my opportunity to unbox it now and show it to you guys. I will of course drop the link to this particular juicer down below as well as um, the one that my friend who sent me this uses so you can make your choice and decide which one you want. I got this one because it was a bit cheaper on my Prime Day deal so and it's still like highly rated so that's why I got this. That was pretty much it. Um, there's a lot of moving parts and pieces, but yeah, I put it in the dishwasher. Tomorrow I'm gonna go to the supermarket and buy all the fruits and veggies that I'm gonna need to try and like make juice a couple times this week, maybe even next week as well. I'm gonna try and make juice on the um, mornings where I don't go to the gym because if I'm going to the gym, I usually don't want to be standing there making juice and then, I don't know. We'll see how it goes, but yeah. Um, anyways, I'm gonna make dinner now. It's the end of the day. I went to school today, so I'm a little tired. So I'm just gonna try and make something quick. I'm making some uh, roasted chicken and sweet potato mash. Pretty simple. It's a HelloFresh recipe. Um, and yeah, that's all. <laughs> it's a very interesting start to the vlog, I know. But don't worry, things will pick up as um, the week goes on. But yeah, see ya. Good morning, guys. Um coming to you live from my kitchen yet again um, with my juicer yet again um, so I know I said I was only gonna juice on days I'm not going to the gym but I'm not going to school today so I figure if there's any consequences from me juicing and then drinking a protein smoothie a few hours later then I will be at home to bear the consequences of those actions you know um, anyways, you're supposed to drink this juice first thing in the morning on an empty stomach, so that's what I'm gonna do now. I peeled, washed, and bagged all my vegetables yesterday, so I wouldn't have to do that this morning. Um, just put it in a Ziploc bag and airtight, uh, try to, like, make it as airtight as possible. Um, so yeah. I'm gonna list the ingredients as I, uh, juice them. I'm tempted to add honey because these are not very sweet. Um, so I feel like it's probably going to be a bit harsh and bitter, but, um, I don't know. We'll see. I'll take a sip first and if it requires honey, then I'll add honey. Um, but yeah, let's get to juicing. <laughs> I'm 
must say i really 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 like the way the um juice is separated from the waste and how like good at getting rid of the waste it is like look there's barely anything inside there just like little bits and pieces um so i have it currently set to the no pulp setting sorry less pulp setting so there's three different grades depending on like how much pulp you want in your juice and i currently have like less pulp but uh, maybe i'll use a different one next time but here's all the bits and pieces so let's taste this and see cheers okay it's not that bitter i can drink this especially because it's so small it's quite refreshing actually mm. i wasn't mad i think i need i might need to add a bit more ginger to the next one though but this is good i highly recommend hey guys long time no see it's been a few days since the last time i vlogged anything um but today is friday today is the day of the barbie premiere so i'm about to film a barbie inspired makeup reel my trusty cameraman guys um, um he is helping me film and set up anything it. helping me <laughs> Um, so yeah, this is the behind the scenes of the makeup reel. This will be long like out by the time that you guys see this. So go check out my Instagram, go check me out on TikTok. Um, go check me out on TikTok and go drop a comment, say that you're coming coming from my video and let me show me the love guys. Show me the love. That's my trusty cameraman over there. Uh here are all my products. Okay guys, this is the final final Barbie look. Let me know what you guys think. I think I look really cute. Um, this is my outfit. I'm just trying to be as Barbie as possible. So yeah, I'm gonna go for drinks first before I head to the movies. So let's go. Oh, I'm really liking this. Hey guys what's up yes the cooler is still sitting in the back of my car because my friend has still not told me she wants to collect it yet clearly she doesn't miss it it's fine at this point it's mine now anyways day after barbie barbie was good it was actually really enjoyable it was a very silly movie i think that's what obviously what they were aiming for but it was very silly and i enjoyed how silly it was um i did miss the first like 15 minutes because i went for drinks with my sister prior um and so i missed 15 minutes because i was having too much fun but it was enjoyable what i saw anyway that was that was good i liked it um i had a very interesting message but everything has an everything has to have an interesting message these days you know but it's okay it didn't ruin the movie um but i don't think it added that much to it either like they could have done without a few things but i think you know they got their message across and it was good Anyways, um, you guys, being a content creator is not easy. Gosh, I spent most of yesterday before going to Barbie editing my vlog and then filming the reel. And then today, this morning, I had to wake up early, um, finish editing the vlog because I was releasing it today, um, which is my girl's trip vlog to DR. By the way, guys, if you haven't seen it yet, go watch it. Um you know drop a heart tell them tell me you're from this video especially if you're new let me know that you're coming from this video um and then now i'm about to go to the mall because i need to get some stuff um i need to get some skincare um some makeup some stuff for my house some of my some things are broken um so i go well it's not broken but i have like these soap dispensers that i was using for aesthetic um and i got an exfoliating uh, hand wash 
but I didn't realize that the pump was too small for the exfoliation seeds or beads or whatever they're called and so they blocked the pump so now it doesn't work anymore I've tried everything to get them out doesn't work literally all that's left is to cut it open and get them out but obviously if you cut it open you can't put it back so might as well just go get a new one and remember to not you know do that again I guess um but yeah so i'm gonna go do that now and then when i come back i have to edit um the reel i shot yesterday because i want to release it tomorrow since barbie's trending right now i want to hop on that trend and try and see if i can get something out of it um also a lot of people were really liking my look yesterday clearly i know a thing or two about this makeup game but yeah anyways i am off to the mall now gonna get a starbucks because i am kind of hungry i didn't think i was that hungry when i left my house but i'm very hungry right now so i'm gonna get a snack from starbucks to keep me through my shopping spree um hope i don't spend too much money today i do tend to do that sometimes anyways yeah let's go shopping guys i actually only entered this place to get a scarf which i have picked up but um then i also picked up this crop top because i don't believe anyone can have too many tiny crop tops and i don't have white well not this kind in white anyway um and then i also realized i want a denim mini skirt which this is so cute um this one particular one is not my size it's actually too big so and this is a small which is it's been happening a lot to me in Zara lately like smalls don't fit me anymore which is interesting because i've actually put on weight so i don't know why that's happening but yeah anyways um so if i can find this in an extra small i am taking it home um i also picked up some earrings some nice pieces because a lot of my earrings have been breaking recently so i don't actually have that many anymore i have like maybe two pieces that i keep wearing over and over um so i just wanted to get these to replace them i might also go into like pandora or something or some other jewelry store to get some more earrings um and like maybe even a necklace as well because a lot of my jewelry i don't know what's going on i don't think they're good quality so maybe buying zara is not the best but I definitely need to invest in some more quality pieces, especially earrings, because those are the ones that like I either keep losing or they keep breaking, and it's just, it's not it. But anyways, do you guys like this fit? Is it given Y2K? That's the look I'm going for. Sorry mom, I know the skirt is too short for you, but it'll be alright. Okay, so I have finished putting away all of my haul. Um, so now I am gonna just make my warm up some leftovers for dinner. Hashtag girl dinner. And then I am going to uh, pour myself a glass of Chapman that I made a few days ago with um, Chapman and red wine, you guys. Excellent, excellent mixture. I discovered it recently. I'm never going back. It's the best thing there ever was. Um, but yeah, so leftovers, Chapman and wine, 
gonna watch the first couple episodes of The Witcher and then I am going to edit my reel. Um, hopefully I'm able to finish all of that tonight. It's already 5.30 um, so I'm gonna try and do relax for like two hours and then around like 7.30 ish I will get on the reel. Hopefully I don't get hungry again tonight. We'll see. <laughs> Hey guys, um, today is Sunday. Today has been a very domestic day. Um, I cleaned in the morning and then I did laundry. Um, I made stew, chicken stew, I made grilled chicken. Um, and now I'm about to devein some shrimp to make shrimp fried rice for dinner. So yeah, that's it's been a very lazy Sunday, honestly. I haven't really got much going on, but I'm about to watch The Witcher. I know I said I was going to be watching The Witcher, um, was it yesterday or day before yesterday? But for some reason, I said it wasn't coming out until the 27th, but then I just put on The Witcher, I'm sorry, I just put on um, Netflix now. I just opened Netflix and I see The Witcher, so I'm confused as to why I'm suddenly seeing that it's out, even though when I tried to watch it yesterday, it said it wasn't coming out until the 27th, which is why I watched Breaker of Ragnarok instead while I was eating, but whatever. I'm not gonna, you know, complain too much. I have my um, Witcher on, so I'm gonna watch that and de bake some shrimp and make my fried rice. Hey guys, so my mic stopped working and um, I didn't realize my mic stopped working for the rest of the video or sorry, for the rest of the clips that I was filming. Um, but yeah, essentially I was just showing you guys my fried rice and showing you that I'm such an adult because I will also be taking it to school for lunch next week um, instead of buying food and spending needless amounts of money. But anyway, this is the end of the vlog. So thank you so much for watching if you watched this far. Um, if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, please do subscribe. I'm trying to hit 2,500 subscribers. And I'm so close. So if you could hit that subscribe button, I would really appreciate it. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.